Day one, Luna. Checking out the house. She has no idea what to do right now. <laughs> Day one of Luna walking around downstairs. Eeyore, you gonna come say hi? You gotta be nice. Zoe, you gotta be nice. Zoe? Zoe, you're gonna be the good one, okay? See, Luna, it's okay. It's okay, pal. We're still so nervous about the whole situation. Like, she's adjusted to us. I'm just so worried about Rika, because she is not happy right now. So I'm hoping that maybe she kind of gets her scent going on. She's not shaking, is she? Luna, are you shaking? I think you might be shaking, hold on. You can come down here, it's not so bad. As long as Diesel's in the other room, he can't bark at you. Whole nother house. Oh, you are shaking. So you wanna come say hi? So nervous. See, this is what I'm so nervous about. See? So he doesn't care, see, look at that. You guys have been giving us so many suggestions, but in the back of my head, I'm still so, so freaking nervous about this whole situation. <laughs> she's so fluffy too. It's like she needs a haircut. I feel like she's part squirrel. There we go, see? You got adjusted to us. There we go. Wander around the house, you do your thing. I'm gonna finish editing. All right, this is the moment of truth. And she's out. Rika came back. God, I'm so nervous right now. Well, the good news is Luna doesn't care. Just the alpha over here. Which is so weird, because she's not normally an alpha. I'm so freaking nervous right now. Dang it, so. You ruined the moment. You ruined the moment with your huffs. Well, that was a start. I'm doing the whole ET thing right now. We could just think of them as Reese pieces. I'm just so surprised she doesn't care. Rika, you're missing spots. Marley's gonna get them. Oh, hi guys. I guess I didn't even say hello. That was an interesting way to start today. It's been a uh, trying morning, that's for sure. Guess what time it is. What time it is. Guess what time it is. What time it is. Actually, you know what was so funny is yesterday, you we're- like You're trying to grow celery? Oh, I'm trying to grow celery. Actually, thank you, Jenny, because I saw you do it, and then I actually looked it up, and um, we're gonna try and do celery ourselves, so it's gonna take a little while. Wait for this to sprout, and you then once it sprouts, is when we can actually put it in the ground. You know what's so, funny, though? What? It's one of these is for one of the drinks, so we're gonna grow one. It's gonna take forever, and then we're just gonna eat it in a second. I have been tossing back and forth on the theme that I want our yard to be for Halloween. I look and sound ridiculous. What is Marley doing? This is my holiday and I like to do something fun. Originally I was gonna do the art of horrors, but I think I'm going to kind of do a mumbo jumbo of things. Um, I think that I'm going to maybe do like a witch's kind of yard where there's gonna be, it's like a witch's graveyard and witches are everywhere and kind of utilize what I already have because like I said, I don't want to spend too much money this year on props when I have tons of them already and I can kind of improvise with what I have. So I think that's precisely what I'm going to do. Right, Dee? Want to be a skeleton dog for Halloween? What are you going to be for Halloween? You're the goofy ass. You are that goofy yes. Yes, you are. Yes. Yesterday, it's kind of funny because we did a little challenge video and we're like, oh yeah, Sunday's going to be for us and we're going to relax and do stuff like that. We ended up being so preoccupied, having so much stuff that we had to catch up on and do yesterday that it actually overflowed into today. Relaxation isn't necessarily a part of our daily life, but that's okay. That's oh, okay. Everyone, this will be kind of semi-relaxing. It's like our one take Sunday turned into a work, work, catch up Sunday. No joke. But well, we got to play a fun game though. We did get to play a fun game. So if you guys have not checked that out, go ahead, click over to the video or in the link down below, in the description down below, there'll be a link to yesterday's video. Go check it out. It was actually super fun and immature and I think it was perfect. My plan also is to potentially have a Halloween party. So I'm like, I gotta have like fun and funky decorations in the house too. I was thinking of getting a couple of these things which were on sale at Michael's. They were originally, let's see, five bucks, but I think they were half off and then I had a 40% off thing. So I got them for really inexpensive and they're little cups and they're glass. So it's like you can even use them as just decorations for next year. So I thought they were pretty darn cool. Very scary Halloween house. I'm a little dramatic, but I'm hoping that'll happen. I think these are keys to our storage unit. However, they have a mark, and I generally put marks on things that are not workable. Oh my God, this time I did it so it's actually work. 
All right, we're good. Goal, we have to get all these Halloween decorations down to the house. It's like going through a treasure chest. Look what I found. Oh, don't drop it, don't drop it. I remember this. Got the brain slug. I think one of you guys actually made this. Got the whole family though. You know what's so funny is like last year we got so much candy. The problem is Allie went to the bathroom for like five minutes and of all these kids came to the door. I didn't know how much to give them. So I was just like giving the bag. I was just like, take what you want. And as a result, I think some kids took, took advantage of me. Yes, Ali's always the cool person. This is like a hundred dollar for candy. I'm not spinning erratically. I'm spinning. Straight. Well, you—it's gifts. It's like essentially gifts. You want some candy corn that was all manufactured in the '60s? I love candy corn, man. Ugh. Oh, by the way, I realized it's been snowing recently in Colorado and I think Utah. But check this out. What is the temperature? It's about 91 degrees. It's 91 here, though. Oh, yeah, you get black trash bags. Oh, we gotta be able. Yeah. Well, you want to go get black trash bags and I'll sit here? Huh? You want to go back to the store? Not at all. Well, you're the best husband in the right. world. I'll do that and you're Thank responsible you for, for this. Thank you for getting me some trash bags so then I can make my Halloween stuff the like best. Do you like my muscles today? No, they're gone. It's because you don't work out anymore. Because I'm more warped toward it. What about if I go like this? Nope, just looks like a colored right. piece of paper. Don't put that. That would hurt so <laughs> bad. Don't get up. Out of here, you freak. Right. It's looking spooky. Fuck. <laughs> I went and got all those skewers. I come back, Allie already has these all I set up. Know. I didn't know that I had any. I'm sorry. It's okay, though. As long as it works. Are we going to put some of those ones that come out of the ground? Then yeah. That goes like underneath one of these, right? Yeah. This guy. You guys already know this. Where's our skull? Did you already take him out? No, that one that we always keep. He's up front. Oh. No, he's She's the only one that I could trust not to run away. All right, this is the important thing. How tall do I want to make this guy? Do you want him to be five foot, six foot, seven foot, eight foot more? I'm very satisfied. Now we got to figure out how to s cleverly scatter these maybe. I guess there's an art form to this, and I'm sure whatever I do, Allie's going to use her spooky, spooky touch and probably do it all differently. But, I mean, it is her holiday, so I don't, I want to offend it. I should just do this and see if she approves it. This is what I've been kind of doing, making it look like he's crawling out. This one's my favorite, though. It's like the feet are just sticking out like it failed. Got random hands everywhere and bones. The winner right there. Wait, I know what I'm going to do. <laughs> Before I forget, come over here real quick. Beautiful bed, beautiful. Out here meeting every dog and person that comes by. <laughs> Can we keep it? I shorten them. I'm gonna leave this here until somebody notices it. Just please don't rip the, <laughs> the rims right off. There you go, everyone's, the only one's off the leash is this one over here, for obvious reasons. Basically sanity. That looks pretty good. Just trash bags and netting. Not bad, babe, not bad at all. D already walked right over there and peed inside it. Not inside it. Oh, on the outside. Sorry. Because you're a jerk. Okay, so I put all the bones right here, right? And then Zoe placed that one over there and started chewing it, so I think she wants it over here. And now you're chewing on this. Yeah, let me see it. That looks pretty cool. There. Yeah, a little progress. Very creative. The look of what the crap am I about to do? Is <laughs> 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 a little shit.
I keep filming this, but I can't help myself. I keep forgetting this is like a cat. Like, she's basically just played off of the high symbol where you would move your right hand or your high hand to the ride. <laughs> this is the longest it's ever taken us to get decorations up. You've been actually slacking on this one. It's been a, it actually has been kind of a busy month or two actually for the last whatever you guys so you know what i'm talking about i don't know if you can hear she keeps running back and forth now that we open the door and she can do her thing good news is that she is running around the upstairs now so i will see you guys later have a good night take care bye 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 ricky you want to play some more drums <laughs>